Good morning, Barra Buddies. This is the week of May 3rd through May 9th. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Did you hear about the kidnapping at school? But it's okay. He woke up. Let's check in with our special reporters to learn about this week in history and some tips for being a Barra Buddy. On May 8, 1945, Great Britain and the USA celebrate Victory in Europe Day, also known as VE Day. Cities in both places put out banners and flags, celebrating the defeat of the Nazis during World War II. Celebrations this week. May 3rd, Lemonade Day. May 4th, Kind Day. May 5th, World Math Day. May 6th, No Homework Day. May 7th, Roast Leg of Lamb Day. May 8th, Donkey Day. May 9th, Lost Sock, Lost Sock Memorial Day. But these are brave. This week, we are focusing on the letter R. R stands for responsible. One way you can be responsible is following along and listening to others. Hi students, this week is the final week to check out books on Friday, May 7th will be the very last day. So hopefully most of you will get to visit the library this week to check out one more time before the end of the year. And then all of our books will be due back to the library on May 14th. So you'll start getting some emails from me and your family will get some emails from me giving you reminders about what you have from the library. And remember, you probably still have some books from November or December when we switch to virtual that might still be at your home somewhere. So don't panic if you see a book that you don't really remember, just look at the title look it up online to see what the cover looks like and then look around your home and see if you can locate it we'll all work together to try to find everything we can and get it back to our library by may 14th good morning Vera. but these, here we are, the week of May 3rd, a new month, and we're super Dr. excited. Dr. Sabatine with the principal's update. Good morning, everybody. Um, this is the week of May 3rd, and we are excited to start another week at Barra School. Um, I think the most exciting thing about this week is it is Teacher Appreciation Week, and so we have an opportunity to show our appreciation and love for our teachers and staff in our building and all that they have done this year to help us have a really great year, even though we've had so many crazy crazy changes that we had to get used to and our teachers have been awesome in helping us navigate through all of that and so this week we are going to thank them with some notes and treats and flowers and other um, acts of kindness to show our appreciation so teacher appreciation week um, we do have a few other things going on as well we'll be taking um, starting our eye ready test for the last time we took this test early in the year middle of the year and now at the end of the year and that's to see how much growth you've made in school this year so work really hard on that we want to see that you have um, yeah made growth during the school year this year in reading and in math um, We'll be packing up some books for Keeps Books coming up and you're gonna hear more about that, which is super exciting. So very soon you'll be able to um, take home some of those books that you um, selected earlier in the year. And then we are having a fifth grade dance this week on Thursday, our fifth graders will get a special dance just for themselves outside. So we're excited about that. And last but not least, it is school lunch hero day on Friday. And so we'll also be thanking our cafeteria workers for all the great nutritious meals they've been feeding us throughout the year. So um, a big week at Vera School, we're really excited. I do wanna give a few shout outs for attendance. Our kindergarten group has been rocking it on attendance. We've had um, several classes that had at least four days of perfect attendance last week, Ms. Clark's class, Ms. Grant's class, Ms. Haley's class, and Ms. Hawking's virtual class all did that. So way to go, kindergartners. And then a few classes had at least two days of perfect attendance, Ms. Seba in fourth grade, Mr. Gardner in fifth grade, Ms. McCollum's third grade virtual students, Ms. Skinner's first graders. 
um, Ms. Barnard and Ms. Bruner's pre-K students, Ms. Leggett's third graders, and Ms. Boyle's second graders. So way to go on attendance. Let's check out birthdays. Happy birthday this week to Tyson Williams, Cooper Sims, Sammy Harper, Amani Pittard, Jeremy Smith, Aiden Deans, Takara Haynes, and Lucille Dunbar. And to Miss Kim. Happy birthday, buddies. Miss Samantha and Mrs. Brink would like to give a humongous shout out to Anna French. Every day she exemplifies being a brave Pharaoh buddy. She challenges herself to go above and beyond with her work. Great job, Anna. We are so proud of you. Ms. Garrett and Ms. Adama are proud of all of Crew 122 for working silently and with focus on mile of milestones. They're a week late, we missed the deadline, but thank you anyway. Crew 122 has some shout outs for Anna for raising her hand and trying even when she's unsure, Harris for working carefully, Isaiah for coming to school more, Andrea for completing her assignments, and Rama for always participating and working hard. Way to go, achievers. They also want to shout out Miss Garrett because she tries to help break up groups so no one feels left out. Hope you all have a great week at Bear School. Ooh, today I, I got a pizza joke. Actually, never mind. It's too cheesy. Before we leave, let's say our barrel honor code to get together. As a barrel buddy, I promise to be fair, honest, and trustworthy, even when no one is looking, because as right thing to do. My good choices will help make Barrow excellent. Now we so now we we will now observe a moment of silence before we begin to focus all of our attention on thinking, learning, and working at Barrow School. Have a nice day.